Hi, I'm Tracy Faulkner from Lush Fabrics with your new fabric releases for today and for this week. Uh, we have another eight, I think, and again, another nice range of fabric bases for you. Um, but before I talk about those, um, I wanted to let you know that you've probably seen on Facebook already, but we have scheduled another date for our next Lush Open Day for those that are here. Um, and we're getting a few people who want to travel over to it now as well. So we're trying to get some dates out a bit earlier. Uh, our next one is going to be on the 20th of March and it's a Friday evening. We're going to have a little sundowner. We're going to have a little few drinks and a few nibblies and that sort of thing. And of course, lots of beautiful fabric. So hopefully some of you can make it for that. We look forward to seeing you. And the other thing I've been asked recently is when are all the winter fabrics coming? We got a huge shipment um, last week, this week, last week. I'm not even sure now. They're, all the days are merging into one another. And it's got lots of amazing winter fabrics in there. I can't wait to start showing you. I may have already taken a couple of cuts home to start making some stuff. Hopefully I say that and then it, it sits in a big pile of fabric at home. But I'll get there. So like the rest of you, I uh, have lots of dreams and things that I want to make and don't always get to it. Fingers crossed. Some really good plans. So you'll see them coming up. Um, they'll start coming in in the next few weeks. The fabric that we're doing at the moment can be used for summer or winter, especially here in Australia. Um, but those more specific winter ones are on their way. Okay, first fabric for today uh, is a double brush poly. And this has got the most amazing background colour. So pretty. So we call this one Endless Sky because it's that beautiful colour. Let me show you the print. It's a bit creased. You can see those colours in that print there. So Double Brush Poly um, is a polyester fabric and it's been brushed on both sides of the fabric. So it's really beautiful and soft on the outside and on the inside. It feels really lovely against your skin. Um, if you have any children around, you may find that they pet you a little bit because you feel so soft. So, beautiful, amazing stretch both ways and really nice drape. So, this has got really great recovery, this fabric, so it'll stretch out but it'll pop straight back in again. So, it's really great to use for something that requires a lot of stretch. Um, but it also has really beautiful drapes, so um, it works well in so many different garments um, because of those two capabilities with it. Now, we have a lot that matches with this one. Let's see if I can pick it up. All right, this is Sand, Double Brush Poly. Pink Bamboo, looks really pretty. The Pale Pink Single Brush Poly, looks really nice. Masala Double Brush Poly, I'm trying to show you the colours in those flowers there as well. Light Olive Double Brush Poly, I'm moving the wrong way again. Uh, green Brushed Cotton as well, looks really nice. And Dusty Mauve Double Brush Poly. Dark Rose, Double Brush Poly, Champagne, Double Brushed, and Camellia Pink, there's lots with this one, Blush, Single Brush Poly, it's really good, it's a great mix that one, Ballet Pink, Rayon Modal, Baby Pink, Cotton Spandex, Army, Double Brush Poly, last one, Vintage Mauve, Double Brush Poly. Lots of options there and of course you'll see all of these on our website in a bit more detail if you want to go through and look again and try and find a coordinate that suits you, um, that you want for this particular print, they're all there. Now the next fabric is the one I'm wearing. So I'm going to show it to you because I've got this great big part of the pattern right here. Um, but there's actually a lot of the pattern that doesn't have a print quite that big. So I just happened to get that big bit smack bang in the middle. Probably should have planned that a little bit better, shouldn't I? 
This is the new base that we have that we released just a couple of weeks ago and it all sold out in the one day. So this is called Pila Spandex. It's 92% polyester and 8% spandex. So it's got really nice stretch. It's You can see it's a little bit, looks like it's a little bit see-through there, but I don't feel like it's see-through at all in my dress. I've got a flowy-ish skirt on here. Um, and I haven't felt like I'm exposing myself today, which is good. Um, let me show you this print. It's got beautiful, beautiful colours in it. So it's got the bigger print and then it's got the smaller flowers. Be amazing in a pair of leggings. Um, you know, if you wanted to use it for an exercise type fabric, it would be fantastic. So, Pillar Spanx, I think I've told you 220 GSM, so it's a bit heavier than your double brush poly. Um, and it's got a slinky feel to it. Feels really nice in this dress. Doesn't feel heavy at all. Um, feels really nice and cool. This is the um, Miss Ruby Tuesday by One Puddle Lane. I haven't made it in such a long time. This is the extended sleeve from the original pattern and the scoop neck. And the skirt is, I think it's style C. It's the um, A-line short A-line skirt from the add-on pack, from the skirt add-on pack. It's really quick to sew up um, and it's right, nice and easy to wear. I use electric purple single brush poly for the bands just to pull out some of that purple colour. So let me show you, this one's got a lot of coordinates as well. So let me show you those. They're all very pretty. So violet double brush poly is one. Strawberry shortcake, single brush poly. Slate, single brush poly. Royal blue 2.0, double brush poly. Should probably hold that out for you a bit more, shouldn't I? There we go, that works better. Um, purple, round spandex, looks great. And the pewter blue, cotton spandex really nice. Peach, oops, lost it now. There we go. Peach, double brush poly is gorgeous with all those lighter bits there. Uh, Blue Ocean, double brush poly. What am I up to? Lavender. So pretty. The Fuchsia Athletic Knit looks really nice as well. So that's um, something to keep in mind if you do want to make athletic wear out of this one. And I think we've got some fuchsia power mesh as well, which might also go really nicely. Uh, where am I up to now? Here we go. Electric purple, that's what I've used, the electric purple single brush poly. Just banned, so it's quite small. But this fabric um, would be great um, as... Um, you know, either a top or shorts or skirt or something like that, something that you can coordinate a solid colour with because you'd have so many options. And I'm sure you've already got something in your wardrobes at home that would match one of these colours in here because there's so many. Chambray, double brush poly. Uh, bubble gum, single brush poly. And berry, double brush poly. It's really pretty. Azure blue, rayon modal, I love this blue, it's so pretty. And last one is the apricot single brushed, also really pretty. So this one, I didn't tell you the name, I don't think, this one's called Spontaneous and it's gorgeous. It's the new peeler spandex. So really nice for, um, you can wear it as athletic wear, active wear um, or as a dress, Cheyenne, when she sewed it up, she made a little top and a skirt. So it's quite versatile what you could do with it. Okay, that is that one. The next one, we've had this one before. This is a different colourway. This one is called Maple in Silver. Now, I want to tell you, before I forget, that when we photographed this one, we didn't photograph it this way, which is how it should go. We photographed it this way. So when you see it on the mannequin you'll see that this faux stitching 
that is in here. This is what it looks like on the back side, but it feels doesn't feel too bumpy at all. In fact, you can hardly feel you can't feel that on the inside really. Um, yes, we've got it shown vertically on our mannequin, but actually the print goes this way. You could wear it either way as long as the stretch works for what you're making. It doesn't matter which way you put it. Um, it can be your preference so long as that stretch is right. Um, because the vertical stretch on these often isn't fantastic. So this is a cotton spandex and it's 160 GSM. It's not a thin, like it doesn't feel flimsy or cheap. It's, um, it's, it feels to me like it's got a pretty good weight to it, which I found with quite a few of these cotton spandexes that we've had lately. Some of them are, you know, 140 or 160 GSM, but they feel thick enough to cover you up, I guess, is what I'm trying to say. It's not like you're going to see everything underneath. It's, you know, it gives you really good coverage still. Very important in clothing, I find. Okay. So it doesn't have a huge amount of stretch horizontally. It doesn't have any vertically. Just a little bit of give vertically, really. And there's the drape. So this is just a beautiful light grey colour. Whoops. You could really... Put anything. Oh, it's not going over my shoulder because I'm standing on it. What a dope. Okay, yeah, so you can put anything with this really um, because it's, you know, it's that beautiful colour that will coordinate with so many things. So we've just done photos and we've showed you with the white tri blend and also with oatmeal rayon modal. Both look really nice. But use your imagination with this one. You could put all sorts with it and it would look fantastic. So that is maple in silver. Okay, this is another print that you have seen before and this is one of our favourite prints of all time. This is Hope and it's in a new colourway. You have Hope in pink. It's looking a little bit peach on my screen at the moment. Um, I guess it does have some peachy tones to it. It's very, very pretty and you can see there's some bigger flowers in there and a few different pinks in there as well which makes it really nice to coordinate so this is a double brush poly so it's lovely and soft it's a really great stretch both ways and really nice drape so this one looks great with pink double brush poly Peachy pink, this is 100% cotton knit, so that looks really nice too. Uh, peach, let me just go back and find the peach. This is peach double brush poly. They're not quite the same colour, but they look pretty good together. Uh, let's see, what's next? Olive, single brush poly. Matches in with those leaves. And... Green. Let's find it. I'm picking up all the wrong ones here. Sorry. This is the green brushed cotton knit, which looks nice. The fairy floss cotton spandex or dark green double brush poly. And dark rose is really pretty. Where's that big flower? With those colors. See, it matches in with those really pretty tones in there. Uh, where am I? Sorry, I've got so many coordinates written down on this page here. And then the next one is Apricot Single Brush Poly. Here it is. Looks really cute. So this is Hope in Pink. Super pretty. And Beth has sewn something up in this, so it's going to look gorgeous. Now, Rayon Shelley. And this one is a border print. It's called Make a Wish because we thought these little flowers here reminded us of those wishing flowers, the ones you pick up and blow and you have to make a wish with. Okay, I probably should have given this one an iron. It's a round shelling, so it is going to get a little bit crinkled. But you can see when I'm standing back that it's got a border print along both selvages. And it's quite a big border print. Um, let's see. 
that's the end of one, that's the end of the other. So you've probably got less than, no, it's probably about a metre, maybe a little bit under a metre in between if you print in the middle. And then you've got the border prints and a great big sticker um, on both selvages there. You can, um, obviously, when we sew, the plan is to sew from selvage to selvage. Uh, or to you know cut your pattern pieces across and with the grain but with these sorts of ones what you probably would want to do is set it up so that you've got that border print either at the bottom of your skirt or the bottom of your top um, so it looks like it is actually meant to be there and it looks really pretty so it means you have to turn the fabric one, one turn to the side um, and use it the other way and it'll work just as well um, doing it that way it'll still sit nicely it won't change the shape of it or anything like that it's just perhaps going against some of the sewing rules that we use so this one it's lovely and light it's 95 GSM it's a beautiful fabric to wear in summer so this one looks really nice with tangerine double brush poly and shamrock green uh, rail modal matches in with those leaves goes with a few reds also goes with the scarlet single brush poly and the real red double brush poly purple rayon spandex also looks really nice with it once I find it the electric purple yes here we go sorry I'm probably shaking the table around there and I let me dress myself again well, that's better, isn't it? That works much better. So purple, round spandex. And I've lost my spot again. My gosh, I'm not doing very well today. Okay, pink, double brush poly. Looks really nice. Lemon, cotton spandex. Very pretty indeed. That goes beautifully with those flowers. Electric purple is in this little bundle here. Try and pick that up. There we go. So that matches. And emerald, cotton spandex. And then the last one is banana, double brush poly, which I think. So I've done a really shocking job with some of these coordinates today. I'm sorry, I'm trying to get myself sorted so they're all on the website. You can take your time and browse through. And see them there but this one is called make a wish and it's a beautiful rayon chalet now I love this next one it's a bit cool I think it's called frisky and it's really not quite a zebra print I guess it is kind of a zebra print but then it's got this gray in it and it looks amazing check it out isn't it beautiful it's a double brush poly Beautiful and soft double brush poly. Great stretch. Both ways. Beautiful drape. Make an amazing dress. A really funky pair of pants. Top cardigan. Oh, there's so much you could do with this one. I'm dying to see what some of you make out of this one. It would be beautiful. Now, colour-wise, it's black, white and grey. You can kind of put anything with it that you like, except for navy blue. Um, and it'll all look amazing. But we've got some here to show you. Let me try and find one of them. It's buried in my pile here already. White tri-blend. Uh, and nickel cotton spandex. And heather grey round modal. And charcoal. Double brush poly, I love that one. And black tri blend. They're all really nice options to go with this one, so I love it. Frisky double brush poly. I hope you love it too, because I really want to see it sewn up. Now, next one, let me just turn my page here so I can keep up with all these coordinates. Uh, you've seen this print before, so this is just another colorway of it. This is the Geometrics. This is a pinky colour. I think the supplier called it red, um, but it's kind of a washed out red. So 
Bridgeport pink. And it's got a bit of um, detail. Can you see those? I think it's got those little textury lines in the fabric there, which I think look really nice. And then just the print is also all the, the lines. So it's a cotton spandex, it's 140 GSM. Again, it's not thin, it's, I've made a t-shirt out of the green one, um, and full, full coverage, total coverage, I, it doesn't feel too thin at all. Uh, so it's got just a little bit of stretch, both ways, just a bit of give more, I think, vertically. Some nice drape, and, it's really nice with cream, double brush poly, and dark mauve, double brush poly as well. It'll be really nice together. So this one is called Geometrics in Pink, and it's cotton spandex. Okay, now we are up to the Lush Sunday Special. So this one is a print that we currently have in stock, and we've had it before. It's another popular print. It's called Dream and this one is Dream in Slate. So we currently have Dream in Mauve in stock, also in double brush poly, which is what this is. This one is a crazy soft double brush poly. Some of them, all of them are lovely and soft. Some of them are exceptionally soft um, and it's like little kittens, it's so soft. This is one of these. So Dream in Slate, double brush poly, amazing stretch. Good recovery, good stretch both ways and really nice drape. So with the awesome stretch, awesome recovery, awesome drape, it means you can make so, so many things, so many different types of garments with this sort of fabric. Pants, skirts, jumpsuits, dresses, tops, cardigans, jackets, you name it. There's just so much that you can do with it. Now this has a very long list of coordinates, so bear with me while I try and find them all, which has been my challenge today, is trying to locate them all. Um, so this is the Lush Sunday Special, which means that it is $14 a metre just for today, just for Sunday. So this looks really nice with slate, single brush poly, and also with pink, double brush poly. And olive, where did I hide the olive? It looks nice with that one too. So in this pile here, that's the army. Where is olive? Oh, exactly where it should have been. There we go, olive, single brush poly, looks great. The mid blue, this is a 100% Cotton knit, looks really nice. Masala, double brush poly, isn't that great picking up all those colours? And light sage, single brush poly, gets those lighter colours in the leaves, as does the next one, light olive, double brush poly, it's really pretty. And it looks really nice with the base colour too, doesn't it? I like those together. Uh, green brushed cotton, again, looks really nice because it picks up the leaves. Picks up all the foliage colours. Duck egg blue, I love this colour. So pretty and it looks great with this background colour. Dark raisin. That is gorgeous with those darker colours in the flowers. And dark green, double brush poly. And then we have chestnut, single brush poly. These tones are beautiful. This, the masala, the dark raisin. I really love those combinations. I think they look really good. They really bring out the right colours in this. Uh, champagne, double brush poly, also looks really nice. And candy pink. This is a cotton spandex, looks great. 50 shades of grey, no, just 50 shades, not 50 shades of grey, we've called this one 50 shades cotton spandex. 
and vintage mauve. Where did I hide that one? Is that it? It looks similar to a few other colours. This is it. Found it. Vintage mauve, double brush poly. And teal blue, double brush poly. Looks really great too. Along with slate bamboo, this one. Um, not a huge amount of this one left, but there is still some there. Pink bamboo. Looks great with this. No, that's not pink bamboo. There it is. Pink bamboo. And camellia pink. Is that one? And then the last one is baby pink, cotton spandex. So just a few options there of what you could coordinate this one with. It's got lots of really pretty colours in there. Uh, so lots of options. So this is your Lush Sunday special. So $14 a metre today just for Sunday. Okay, that is everything for today. I hope you like our new fabrics. Um, and as always, we have our competition in our Facebook group, so Lush Fabrics and then Australia in brackets is our Lush Fabrics group on Facebook. Uh, we run a competition just about every week uh, to give away a $50 Lush Fabrics gift card. All you need to do is comment on this video post and you can comment as many times as you like because each comment is an entry. Thank you so much for bearing with me the whole way through this. It took a little while with all those coordinates. Uh, but that's it for now, and I'll see you again next week. Thanks. Bye.